Oi, oh, everybody! Juliana here. Today it's time for another quick and easy recipe. Swedish meatballs. This is a very easy meatball recipe that you can make using only one bowl, with a very creamy, delicious sauce to bring it to the next level. So, let's cook! Into a large bowl, add 600 grams of ground lean beef. You can also use a mix of meats to make your meatballs. Pork and beef are very common. Add a half of a meat and yellow onion cut into small cubes. Three smashed cloves of garlic. About six stems of thyme picked and chopped. One teaspoon of my dry rub. Same one from my ribs video. You can check it out in the description below. Or you can use any other rub for beef you have. One teaspoon of black pepper. One teaspoon of salt. One tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce. One quarter teaspoon of chili powder. One egg beaten. One quarter cup of cream. The cream in this recipe gives an extra moisture to the meatballs. Six tablespoons of breadcrumbs and one tablespoon of olive oil. Mix with a spatula and use your hands to combine very well until it all comes together. Using a tray with parchment paper, make balls using a scoop or just with your hands. It's good to use a scoop to make it an even for your presentation and for cooking. The one I'm using makes 2 inches balls. You can also make them any size you want. Here in our house we like them big. Bake the meatballs at 425 Fahrenheit or 220 Celsius for 15 to 20 minutes. You can also check the temperature using a thermometer if you want. It should be 160 Fahrenheit inside. Now it's time for you to drop a like if you enjoy this video. And if you're new here, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more amazing delicious recipes and food adventures. There will be golden brown on the outside. You might see some fat coming out of them, it's normal, and they will go away when you take them off of the tray. While your meatballs are baking, make the sauce. Into a medium saucepan, add 4 tablespoons of butter. When it's all melted, add 3 tablespoons of all-purpose flour. Stir cooking until it becomes a light amber color. Add 2 cups of beef stock. Make sure to use a good quality low salty one, or homemade is even better. Stir and add 1 cup of cream. Keep stirring and add 2 tablespoons of Worcestershire sauce, 1 teaspoon of ginger mustard, black pepper to taste. Stir the liquid until it boils and gets thicker. Add salt to taste. Cook until very creamy and thick, about 5 minutes. Turn off the heat and add the meatballs into the sauce. Add some fresh chopped parsley and enjoy! This dish is amazing not just to eat as a meal with some rice or vegetables, but also very good as an appetizer with some sliced toasted bread. Very creamy, the meatballs are very juicy, and all together makes a perfect bite. I hope you enjoyed! See you in the next video! Ciao! Hey guys, thank you so much for watching! If you liked this video, make sure to drop a like here 
If you're new here, make sure to subscribe here. On Bake Cook Travel, we always bring the best food adventures and food recipes. If you'd like to see more food recipes, click here. And for more food adventures, click here. See you in the next video.